Alright guys, we're back in my garage and uh, I'm working on testing uh, potency of gas or actually how much of one mixture do you need to air of HHO for it to ignite or ignite violently. Um, so what I've done here is I've got a couple of numbers and I've got a little uh, it's a spice can. Basically you can take the top off. Okay, and it's got a slot there and it's got a slot on the other side here for you to shake spices. But what I'm going to use it for um, is to fill with different parts of HHO or Brown's gas or whatever you want to call it and uh, I'm going to try to ignite and see what kind of mixtures we need to uh, get it to ignite. So I have some figures here and basically uh, I found out that uh, one one thousandth of a liter equals one cc or one centimeter squared and that also equals one milliliter so what I've done here is this cup here measures one hundred and fifty milliliters okay so um, bought myself a little syringe it's a cooking syringe it is thirty cc's I don't know if you guys can see that it's 30 cc's total, okay, and I've hooked up the measuring rig, but I've made it so that um, this doesn't have a second tube down in it. So basically, what's happening is HHO is filling up in this gaseous space here, and it's forcing out in this little tube and coming out and bubbling up over here. So I have pure HHO in this bottle at one atmosphere pressure. Um, this one would always be mixed with air, somewhat. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the syringe, I'm going to take samples of the pure HHO, I'm going to inject it into this, which I know is 150 uh, milliliters, okay, it's, or cc's, and um, see how much we get to ignite, what we need to get it to ignite. Um, over here, what I've done is I've hooked the PWM, okay, I've hooked that up to a... Uh, same setup here with a spark plug, the ignition coil, and um, a ground and a battery powering the whole thing. I'm going to get some better lighting over here so you guys can see. I'll be right back.